Hey, today I'm talking about the new Netflix movie, May December. This stars Natalie Portman and Julianne Moore. And the basic premise is, I'm gonna be a little vague because I do think it's a little bit more fun if you don't exactly know what's going on. It is fine if you do know a bit, but I think this is one of those movies where it's just like, it's a bit more fun if you're just like, what is happening? What are they all not saying that they should be talking about? So essentially, Natalie Portman plays this actor. Sure. Her next project is based off of this real life person and so she goes to meet this real person played by Julianne Moore and live with her family for an extended period of time just to try to get like you know some mannerisms down and learn more of the story and it's really good. Both of them give such great performances and it's such an interesting story too because it gives you just little tastes of the mystery throughout the whole thing and then as you're realizing stuff and just realizing how like messed up everything is. It just really, really works. And Natalie Portman gives such a great performance too, because like you kind of feel for her. People kind of react to her weirdly at times, but then like she also isn't maybe the most nice person. Maybe she's kind of a little messed up too, but in a different way. And man, oh man, does it go to like, I don't want to get your expectations too high, but like it kind of has a bit of a crazy end. It's not the most insane thing, but I was just like, wait, are they going to go there? And then they did. And it was gross. But in like a good storytelling type of way. So yeah, I thoroughly enjoyed this movie and would totally recommend it. I would extra say just don't really do any more research into it. Just kind of go into the movie as blind as you can because I really do think that adds a bit of fun to it. And just yeah, experience weird strangeness that is May, December. If you do know what May, December means, that does refer to a thing. I forgot I actually knew what it meant until after the movie and then I'm like, okay, that makes sense. That does give you a hint of what it's about. But yeah, no, go into it as blind as you can. And and it'll be a good, interesting experience. And now for my ranking, I put this at number 28 in the really like section. And this is at a total of 77 new movies so far this year.